Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you again for, uh, well, mid this afternoon for a movie review this time. And this is for The Hitman's Bodyguard that I'm actually deciding to review. And also, I have to review this first before watching the sequel to it. Which this movie review for the sequel will probably be out. I think Tuesday or Wednesday, or sometime tonight, I'll try to get to it as soon as possible. Most likely, one of these days I'll watch it, but I'm going to discuss what I watched for this movie review for the Hitman's Bodyguard. Bodyguard, oh, sorry if I'm sounding a little stuttery-ish. <laughs> uh, the 2017 movie, and let you know my thoughts on it. So let's dive into this review. Now, this stars Ryan Reynolds, Samuel L. Jackson, Selma Hayek's in a few scenes in this movie. But, yeah, the main focus in this movie is on Ryan Reynolds and Samuel L. Jackson. And pretty much, uh, Ryan Reynolds has to protect Samuel L. Jackson, who apparently is a killer assassin. And a paid gets paid to kill people, of course, uh, his targets or whatever, so Samuel L. Jackson's kind of a bad guy or whatever in the movie, but Ryan Reynolds is like the CIA operative until his, one of his clients goes, that he protects, gets killed by Sam Samuel L. Jackson, but it's kind of funny what he said in the movie. There's a lot of humor in this movie, and I really like this movie. I think it was a pretty well-made movie. Um, there's some scenes in it that I don't know if I like as much, but the jokes really do land in this movie, and I really like the aspect about how their chemistry, Ryan Reynolds and Samuel Jackson in this movie, they their chemistry with their performances, I mean to say, are pretty good. So, the jokes really land in this movie, and Selma Hayek's pretty funny in this one, too. So, yeah, I just wanted to review this movie first before getting to the sequel, which is the new movie, of course. The Hitman's Wife's Bodyguard, which it took them about four years to make that one. Uh, but, that's fine. Um, overall, I think this movie was very well written and very well executed. Uh, I don't know if it's the best movie, but it, it, it is a pretty good movie. I didn't get a chance to watch this one because I was so unsure about watching this movie. I was like, eh, I'm going to avoid watching it, but I'm glad I did because it's a very good movie. Uh, I highly recommend you check it out if you haven't seen The Hitman's Bodyguard with Ryan Reynolds and Samuel L. Jackson in it. And pretty much it's about Gary Oldman's in this movie, but he plays a villain in this movie. A pretty bad guy. A really bad, bad guy, I guess you could say. <laughs> uh, but as his character, of course, not in real life. But... Yeah, I really thought this movie was very well executed, but the jokes really are funny in this. <laughs> I I just like that one joke where he's like, uh, I popped that guy for you or whatever. Or I popped your client or whatever that Samuel Jackson said to Ryan Reynolds and then Ryan Reynolds got really pissed off. <laughs> so yeah, for a score, I'm going to give the Hitman's Bodyguard uh, 8.5 out of 10. This was a pretty good movie, and I highly recommend you check it out if you haven't seen it. I definitely want to own this movie, because it is worth owning. It's such a good movie, and I was really impressed. Uh, I did not think I'd like this movie, but I'm glad I got to check it out before I decided to watch the new one, because I probably wouldn't have understand the concept with the new one. If I didn't watch the first one, of course. But, yeah, definitely comment below 
let me know what you guys thought of the movie review I did for uh, The Hitman's Bodyguard if you've seen this movie. And if you like this movie review I did for you guys uh, today, comment below and let me know your thoughts on it. Tap a like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you can to support the channel. I will be returning to you for another movie review. Probably going to be during the week this time. Um, I won't be returning to you tomorrow night for a movie review. I was going to do the Forever Purge, but I just wanted to watch this movie. And then, I think by Tuesday or Wednesday night, I'm going to definitely review the Hitman's Wife's Bodyguard and give that movie a shot and see what I think of it. But, I hope you didn't find this movie review to be enjoyable. Sorry about the beginning of the video. I know it's kind of bothersome with me stuttering and talking a little too fast and getting excited over reviewing this movie. But, I quite enjoyed it. It was a very enjoyable movie. I like the action scenes in it. And, yeah. I think Gary Oldman plays a Belarus uh, guy named Dur or Something with a D. I just can't remember. Dulkovich or something like that. I think that's what his name was. This? Dulkovich. Um... But, yeah, I hope you did find this movie review to be enjoyable. I like the comedy in this movie. It's very hilarious. There's a lot of funny points in this movie. And, yeah, there wasn't really a lot of disappointing moments. There may have been some, but, yeah, I still enjoyed it as a whole for what it was. And sorry about my yawning. Uh, but stay safe. Take care. Hopefully you enjoyed this movie review. And I'll see you in my next video.